Hey, everybody. Uh, we are live here in the Dilworth Library. It's Coach Reynolds. Uh, in case you didn't know, I like libraries and reading books, and you should too. Uh, we're here in the fiction section of one of the greatest libraries in all the land, the Dilworth Library, available to you if you are a Dilworth student or related to a Dilworth student, maybe. Uh, Today, we are actually going to be going over uh, a new feature uh, that the Dilworth Librarian has procured for our students and even our staff as well. Um, so we're going to go over how to access some ebooks and also some audiobooks that are available to you for free. So here we go. Uh, we're going to try this and see how it goes. It might be a total flop but Bear with me, please. Okay. Um, so, first thing you need to do is get on to the internet. The name of this new program that we have is called Macinvia. Uh, so you can get on to there, um, or you can go through one of my favorite pages, uh, the Dilworth Library Landing. You just Google search Dilworth Library Landing if you don't already have it on your bookmarks, you lunatics. Um, you just click through the library landing there and you can see that um, our lovely librarian here at Dilworth has done a ton of work putting this together for all of us to have the resources in the same place um, and have access to them. So uh, props to her for putting all this together. Uh, and you can see there's a ton of stuff there. We'll be going through and doing videos on how to access a lot of this stuff um, as the Dilworth YouTube channel grows. But today, uh, like I said, we are uh, gonna be trying to tackle this Mac and Via. Um, for those of you that maybe you're doing distance learning or on the days that you're not actually in school, it's a great way to kind of keep your brain working and or even just, you know, enjoy some entertainment uh, in the form of a book. The theater of the mind, as I like to call it. So the first thing you're gonna do is either click through that Mac and Via link on the website or, uh, you know, Go through the other channels, the Googles or the Bings or the Face Boxes or the Insta Pants, whatever you do, you do. Uh, so, first thing you got to do is put in your school name, and it should start to pop up as I put in Dilworth. Uh, Dilworth Middle School is the one you want because obviously we're not in Charlotte, North Carolina, or Dilworth, Minnesota. There's actually a, a city called Dilworth. Who knew? I think it's a different fella that that's named after. So that brings up Dilworth Middle School, Sparks, Nevada. Double check it, make sure it's correct, and we are going to log in. Now, uh, when you are logging in, uh, it skipped a step there because I had already logged in earlier to make sure everything was working. Um, so I'm on my account right now. But uh, what you will do for students, first thing uh, is first, you probably should come down to the library and get one of these fancy bookmarks right there. And that'll tell you exactly how to get in there. But uh, for students that are maybe at home or you just don't want your friends to see you going into the library, uh, you will use your student ID for your username and your password will be your last name. Uh, so please don't log on to other people's if you know their student ID. I guess them reading more books wouldn't be the end of the world, but uh, read your own books if you would, please. Uh, but again, user ID is your student ID number. Everybody should know that. And uh, your password would be your last name. You should also know that. If you don't, for some reason, know either of those things, you can come see Ms. Waddell in the library and we'll help you kind of figure out because uh, I know that some some last names are hyphenated. Uh, so we'll we'll try to help you solution find and get to the bottom of that. Um, so Mac and Via, here we are. Once you go through the login, it should pull up uh, to say, click here for WCSD SSO library login. And that's what you're gonna do. Click on that bad boy and bingo bango, we're in. And you have a, a, a ton of books here, uh, hand-selected by the Dilworth Librarian, um, just for us. So uh, you can enjoy all sorts of things. The one that I was really, I had my eye on, I'm not seeing it right now. I do love the book Hatchet. That is a classic. 
book there, but the one that I was looking at was uh, the notorious RBG uh, about uh, Supreme Court Justice Ruth Bader Ginsburg. So you can use the search bar here uh, if you want to take my recommendation. Notorious RBG. Boom. And there you go. Notorious R RBG, The Life and Times of Ruth Bader Ginsburg. Maybe you read it and I read it and we can give it uh, a review here. I haven't read it yet, so uh, that would be good. It's helpful to everybody when you review books um, and just let them know what you think of it. That way they know whether they should check it out or not. Um, but you can listen now to that. That's one that is available on the audio. Uh, so you just click listen now and there it goes. I like how she said that in a very notorious RBG kind of way. There you go. Uh, that is uh, Mac and Via in a nutshell. We also have on there, um, in addition to the audiobooks, there are a ton of ebooks, uh, and the, the process is going to be about the same for that. So we'll just click on one of those really quickly. 20,000 Leagues Under the Sea, classic Jules Verne novel about a submarine that goes way down below the surface of the water. You just click open now, and there you are. Uh, this is also available on your phone. If you would like to download the app, it is the same, uh, Mac and Via, M-A-C-K-I-N-V-I-A. -A. Uh, just look for it on your app store for whatever phone you do have and it'll bring it right up and you will have uh, access to all these amazing books. Special thanks to our Dilworth librarian and the library staff. It's just one person. But she's, it's like there's 10 people in here, I'll tell you. Is there anything else that we need to include here? Did I nail it? More or less. Hopefully these will get better as time goes on. This one is a rough, there's a rough draft. Okay, good, 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 good. Okay, so there's Mac and Via. If you have questions or um, anything like that, please come see us in the library and we'll help you out. Um, make sure to like, share, and subscribe. Cause that's what you're supposed to say, right? Uh, to the Dilworth Library page. Um, and more videos will be coming soon. So I'm gonna stop sharing now. And we will say, uh, that's it for today, folks. Mac and Via, log on. Get your book on. If you don't know, now you know. See that? That was a notorious B.I.G. reference at the end. All right. See you next time, everybody. Have a great day. Oh, no, no. We'll do this. We'll make it a great day. Nights. Take care of yourself and each other. Be nice. And don't forget to be awesome. Home run.